Welcome to Text Aloud. Once you've installed Text Aloud, it's easy to get started and explore the program, and this video will show you how. Double click the program icon or select Text Aloud from the Windows Start menu options, and you're on your way. As you launch Text Aloud, Notice the easy and intuitive menu interface, which operates just like your other familiar Windows programs. As Text Aloud opens for the first time, you'll see that a default text article is immediately present on screen. Make sure that your computer's volume is set at a comfortable level for listening, then click the Speak button. Thanks for trying text you should aloud. then be able to hear Text Aloud read the default text. text so that you know the installation went properly and everything is working okay. Next, try the Text Aloud clipboard prompt. With Text Aloud running, highlight some text in another application, such as Microsoft Word, for instance, or from a favorite website. Then click Control C, which is the shortcut allowing you to copy that text to your clipboard. You can also right click your mouse and choose Copy. This also puts your text into the Windows clipboard. Once you copy your text in one of these two ways, this will bring up the Text Aloud clipboard prompt on the bottom right side of your screen. The default choice when this occurs is Add New Article, so you'll then just click Perform, and your text will appear on screen as a new Text Aloud article. Depending on your PC work habits, you may need to tweak the clipboard prompt by adjusting its parameters. To personalize your clipboard prompt preferences, just click Tools, General Options, Clipboard, and Mouse Speak Options, Clipboard Options. For example, to ignore small amounts of text that may be simple unrelated cut and paste operations, or to display the clipboard prompt for a longer period of time. Another way to hear your text read aloud is to use the Text Aloud toolbar available in Microsoft Word, Microsoft Outlook, Microsoft Internet Explorer, and Firefox. When Text Aloud is installed, just go into the other program and make sure to enable the Text Aloud toolbar so that it will be displayed in that program. That's all it takes. Once this is done, you'll be able to highlight some text and then simply click on the Speak button within the other program to listen while viewing the text. So you can listen within Microsoft Word, for instance, as seen here, without ever leaving the program or opening up Text Aloud separately. Once you've installed Text Aloud, Text Aloud will also open some file types directly. Click File, Open, and then if you click on the drop-down, which defaults to All Files, you'll see several file types that can be opened directly in Text Aloud. Text Aloud can open and speak a variety of file types, from ASCII text or rich text files, to Microsoft Word documents, to PDF files, and many more. Please note that some PDF and other ebook files may be protected, and if that's the case, access to the text will be blocked and you won't be able to open the file directly. If this occurs, you may or may not be able to access the text by cutting and pasting the text, or possibly by saving the file to another format. Once you get started, you'll also find that Text Aloud has many popular features, including conversion to audio file, once you've installed Text Aloud, file splitting, and batch file conversion utilities, optional hotkeys, and many more exciting actions available under the Tools menu option. 
This has been just a brief look at how to get started with Text Aloud, so please look forward to future videos to come that will continue to explore additional helpful features and functions. Meanwhile, don't forget to visit us on Facebook, Twitter, or on the web at www.nextup.com. And as always, thanks for listening.